Yo, hello guys and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial guys, I will be sure to show you how to create Pinterest ads for your Shopify product. So, first of all guys, without any further talking, let's get ahead into Pinterest. So go to here to Pinterest and from here, Pinterest like that. Uh, let's go to Pinterest.com. And as you can see from here, you will have to go to your account and make sure that your account is actually on the business mode. So as you can see, I have the business access. So and basically what the business what the business account access gives you is it gives you an account and analytics account. So it gives you multiple choices to go through all of these. So now let's say that you have already created your account, you have your business account. So how we can actually make um, ads campaign for your Shopify product. First of all, you will have to have like a Shopify account or store. So let's go to Shopify, log into our account and let's go to my account. So here it is. And now make sure that you have products in your Shopify store. That is pretty easy. You just have to go to products and then you can add your products over here by adding title, description, media. So you can do whatever you'd like as you can see, title, description and here you can just put the pricing as you can see here and click on save when you finish all of these things now this is my account and after i finish with that continue setting up your store so when you finish creating your account you just have to go to that or do that product and then go and copy it link so just go visit your website and copy the link of this uh product now after you finish with that go to pinterest and then search after you created your business account in pinterest search for pinterest ads and this is the website that you show open so ads the pinterest.com and that's how the page must look like now how we can create our first campaign that is pretty easy go to create campaign and here you just have to choose manual campaign automated campaign i'm going with that and then click on get started i'm going to click here to create a new one and here it is so now you can create campaign details so this is one this one is for build awareness drive consideration get conversions and each one of these has its own parameters so for example put awareness it means that help people to discover your brand products and other services so there is no links in the in this ad there is nothing that they will click on there is nothing like that so they only have like a video or an image to see the second one which is get more click on your ad on pinterest so maybe there is a link maybe there is like an image that will take you to somewhere else so this is the thing that will take them to us somewhere else now in our case in our shopify case we are going to use case conversions because this will drive people to take actions on your website which is our store which is our shopify store now let's go here let's name this with shopify shopify products and here let's choose conversions so set up conversions data and here let's click on get started add web url let's copy this add it here check and now let's gonna load for us so this is great your website is eligible for one of our integration partners shopify so here i'm going to click on continue 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 and this is it will show you how to actually do that so now go to shopify and select your store so i am on shopify now go to home and click on apps as you can see over here now from here guys search for uh print it search for it let's go here and in here we shall visit your shopify app store and we must search for pinterest so let's do that and pin to rest as you can see here here it is so now i'm going with this one so i'm going to download this one and as you can see the app is not compatible with the store so why i have a business address set in any of these countries so for me i can't really add it because i'm not eligible for it and i don't really have um an email in one of these countries but for you guys it will be easy if you had an email in those countries so when you finish setting it up all of these things following these steps that you have in here um when you finish with that and still up continue you will be ready to go now let's go back to our ads and let's go to create and let's finish with that so let's say that you have actually chose this and we could do that 
uh, the next step which is going here Shopify product here we're just gonna give a name for our campaign here we're gonna make it active daily so you can choose either you want it to be daily so e each day you will pay an amount of money or for lifetime and you will pay a huge amount of money so and I'm going to pick daily and here I'm going to pick um, $10 per day for example here's the end date let's make it seventh so after two days and let's click on continue now here we are going to choose either targeting details so selected strategy to use you connect with users find new customers or choose your own so you can retarget people who have already interacted with your brand so if you have any audience you can just select them and add them over here here you can find new customers so prospect people who haven't interacted with your brand and here you can make mark targeting selections for this ad group without guidance recommended for experienced advertisers only so you can choose whatever you'd like from here i'm going with this for example and i'm going to just uh, keep it like that now let's go all the way down over here here you can add some interested keywords and here you can choose the demography demography means you can choose the gender so if you were for example selling um I don't know, male underwears, you can just remove these two and keep it for male. Here we can choose the, the age, so if you are only selling like for like between 18 and 34, you can choose this one and remove all of these because you know the size will not fit all of these and maybe you are going to specific location, so you are selling only in specific location, you can choose for example here the US and if you don't want even all the US, only some specific locations in the US, you can even choose that from here. So you go to regions and here you just have to choose whatever region you want, for example New York and here you go. Now let's go all the way down, you can choose the language so we can just remove this and search for English add English and here you can choose a specific device where you want it to be so for us I'm just gonna keep this uh, iPad and iPhone and web so like that I'm gonna be good here you can place it in tracking you can add that as well so this is how it will look like for you and that's it now we're gonna make it a browse research etc and we will finish that with Go into here to make enter a bid if you'd like to maximum to add a maximum optimization and delivery thanks to you and here you, you here where you put your post that you want to make it as an ad so here I'm going to select pins from my already created pins add pin here so this is my pin now all I'm going to do is click on publish and here I'm going to add here for example a hundred so here we go um, let's make it for example eight and publish now they will take us to our business account we have to fill these affirmations first so let's fill that with some random affirmations and let's choose this for example and here we go now they will give us the billing address so here we must put all the affirmations about ourselves which has to be correct a hundred percent because if anything was wrong here your account will not be eligible for creating ads so now all you need to do is fill this information put here your payment type fill this with your correct card information click on save and then they will redirect you to the campaign and you will be able to publish it so yeah guys that was it that's how you can actually make a campaign for your shopify product so thank you guys for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial